Hello everyone, welcome back for one more episode of Fallout 4 before I go to work. In the last episode we made our way through the Donut Shop's Escape Tunnel Secret Laboratory thingy. This episode we're going to burst our way out through the front, but not before taking a stim pack. Ah, oh, that's the stuff. Alright, let us go. But first, dance, I need you to carry some stuff. Anything useful? Hey. Ready. Can you stop moving away? Can you swap some gear? Yes, I want to swap some gear. Take the Institute pistols, please. Including the night vision pistol. Shadow metal right arm, all this stuff. Until so you cannot carry any more. Uh, let's see. Automatic Institute pistol. Deliverer. Anything else? Incendiary pistol. I think that's everything. Alright, let's go. I'm gonna sell all that crap. Now, which way we're we going this way? Oh, there's a weapons workbench here. Yeah, here. Pocket mine. Ooh, hazmat suit. Could be useful for something later. Might allow me to go through <laughs> the sea, the glowing sea, without a, uh,. Without power armor. I was in error. No enemy detected. Sure, you were in error. I am. Yeah, you were not in error. If you're wondering why I'm using this instead of a laser weapon, well, stockpiling ammo at this point. Do I have to use the terminal? No. Oh. Alright. Do we get to go in guns blazing? Going up. Oh, that's great. Oh, hold up. Alright, we are back. Sorry for the brief cut. But we are... Ooh, hot plates. And aluminum. Ooh, more aluminum. Ooh, a piece of candy. I know we've got a job to do here, but... There's just stuff I need to take. Oh. What's this guy? Oh, there's a bobby pin in that guy's suitcase. Do 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 do. Hey, does this go out to the wastes? Yes, it does. I thought this brought us back to the donut shop. I might want to try salting the donut shop head on, unless there's like gen ton of gen twos there. You can see them trying to rescue the Gen 2s, not the Gen 1s. Curious. Leave the switchboard. Hello. Wait, what's my next objective? Meet Deacon at the Old North Church. Alright. I have found you. Hi, dude. Hi, dude. Oh, no more. Well, there goes the minefield. Hmm. More hot 
plates, thank you. Oh, about time you got here, Dance. I think that's all of them. Can I, can I not get stuck, please? Thank you. Yay for pre-war money. Hmm, toaster, cool. Wait, was this really the frontal assault we were so afraid of? Oh, they weren't kidding. There is a minefield around here. Ow! Alright, let us actually disarm the, that time. Alright, and let's go. Fast travel. Wrong marker. Isn't there an easier way to get down there? Eh. No, I have to go through their damn tunnels every time I want to go back down to their secret base area place thingy. Best loading screen ever. Okay. Ah, oh, look at the amount of... There we are. Look at the amount of laser rifle ammo I have. Ah, uh, this makes me happy, Butters. I can now actually use my laser rifle without having to worry. Ah, uh, okay. As long as there's no new ghouls, I should be fine. I just went the wrong way, didn't I? Damn you, Dance. Really? Can't they, like, make a secret entrance t that leads to the ground level or something? Do do. As long as no new uh, ghouls show up, I will be happy. And the new guy patched me up, put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. Since everywhere. Carrying you the whole time? Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Deacon told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. Uh, so is any of that true? Go with Deacon's lie. Mostly true, but there weren't a hundred of them. And Deacon was with me the whole way. Embellishing the truth again, are we? She would have fallen for it, you know? Don't flatter yourself. <laughs> Still... I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. You've certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about, or lied about, anyone so highly <laughs> before. Welcome to the railroad, Agent. Sweet. Why should I join you? If you're having any doubts, you shouldn't. Not very many of us live to retirement. But if you're like me, that doesn't matter. There are great wrongs that need writing. Glad to be aboard. It seems we're very lucky to have you. So you're in. I don't think Dance is gonna like that. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Co uh huh. Uh, fixer, professor. Have any no, it doesn't work like that. Ooh, I like whisper, but I'm not really quiet. Bullseye. Call me. Bullseye. Well, from what Deacon says of your fighting skills, Bullseye seems apt. Your first official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his prototype and see if he can use another pair of hands. But first, it's time to meet the rest of the game. Alright. Sometimes the direct approach so be careful is coming in thing. or out. You never can tell when you're being watched. 
Sweet, we have completed the Tradecraft mission. I wonder how Dance feels about all this. Not that I particularly care. He'd sooner wipe out all these. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe, and we've taken precautions not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now, so there's plenty for you to do. This individual is busy. Of course she's busy. Well, this place certainly looks like it could use a little tidying up. Alright, well. Tinker Tom. This is Bullseye. He did the switchboard out with Deacon. He's a full agent, effective immediately. I'm counting on each of you to show him the ropes. Feel free to welcome him aboard. That is all. It's not an easy road you've chosen. But you're never alone in this area. Welcome to the family. We're a colorful and arguably insane bunch. But you're stuck with us now. Speaking of which, if you don't mind a sidekick, let's keep a good thing going and travel together some more. Uh. Don't they need you here? Our job's mainly intel. So, the more places I go, the better I'm doing. And you are just one big, beautiful distraction. Plenty of opportunities to learn secrets moving around in your shadow. Eh. Not right now. Well, if you change your mind. Make sure you're never followed here. It's all our asses if you are. Alright, well, let's see. Tinker Tom's cooking up something. Well, I, everyone's sleeping, so I should wait until they're all awake. I mean, it's only, it's only fitting. Can't they get the sarcophagus out of here? Like, really? That's just rude. Got a power armor station here too. That's awesome. For all the people that use power armor here. Drummer boy said that Deacon is a sin. I don't know. Maybe. What? You don't believe Drummer? Deacon's face is going to be like men named Let's go ahead and wait until people are definitely going to be awake. Exploring the railroad. Every so often, boom, new idea. It's hard to keep track. Maybe I'm the wrong idea. Ah, sin. it's our newest age of sin. Glad, Glad you, you signed on. Listen, you may not even I might get to take the occasional take night off. He spent a year as a cool. Hey, Lori. Oh, hey, you. So the switchboard was crawling with bad guys. Mine's in the ship, too. There's that no true? way Deacon was Deacon is bullshitting me. Well, I didn't do it alone, but yeah, that's about the size of it. That's hardcore. How'd you take down the old HQ? Please tell me you didn't go along with Deacon's in and out like a ghost crap. Nah. With a whole lot of bullets and a whole lot of blood. <laughs> Fortunately, the blood wasn't mine. That's how you do it. Well, welcome to the party. After what happened to Tommy Whispers. We need another tough son of a bitch that can get shit done. All right. Thanks for inviting me. We should, I don't know, bake a cake? That's what you do, right? Nah. They call me Glory, the angel of death, the ass-kicking poster child of a liberated synth. You really are a synth, right? You weren't pulling my leg before. That's what the maid in the Institute stamp on my ass says. Wait, really? I have a lot of questions about synths, about the Institute. Would you be willing to answer a few? Every rook comes in here and wants to interrogate me. I don't got the answers you want, okay? I don't know where the Institute is, how to get there. All right. I'm done talking. Damn. Hey, Glory. Hey, you. So the switchboard. I didn't do it alone. That's hardcore. All right, let's go ahead and skip all this crap. With a whole lot of bull. That's, well. Uh-huh. We should. Uh -huh. They call me Glory. I like it. It's not to like. You're helping out my people. So some advice? Kiss up to Tinker Tom. He's batshit crazy, but he's got all the good stuff. All right. What sort of good stuff are we talking about? Firepower, armor, repurposed tech. Doesn't hold a candle to the Institute, but it'll save your ass in the field. You take care out there. 
I like Glory. She's awesome. Why couldn't she be my partner instead of Deacon? Where did Tinker Tom go? Deacon's record is the best. You can learn a lot from him. You gotta be careful, man. The Institute is everywhere. I like this guy already. Hi. The census sweep says you're clean. Hooray! We're bug free. <laughs> I went through a sensor sweep. Every test does would let me run. Full EMF scan, biological sniffers, and other state-of-the-art security. Awesome. The says the Institute isn't watching you, or us. But the tests lie, man. Okay, have you eaten anything out there? Because if you have, they got you. Nah. Yeah, I've eaten food. Well, I knew it. The Institute has these tiny microscopic robots in the food, man. And they report back. Tom, oh, <laughs> that's rubbish. You just don't get it, character. The Institute is in your blood. <laughs> True, that's terrifying. If he had a shred of evidence for any of it, agreed. <laughs> Quite terrifying. <laughs> okay, okay. If you really want to be safe, let me give you a little shot. There's, there's the moment. Says no one has to, but it will kill those little robots. There's battery acid in that serum of yours. <laughs> you can omelet without irradiating some eggs. You ready to shoot up? No way. There's no way in hell I'm letting you do that. But let them hear and see everything. Okay, okay. I hope you like your whole life being downloaded to the Institute's mainframe. I love this guy. Actually, I dose myself with radiation to kill the blood robots. I read you, man. Smart. I'd rather have some hair loss than let the Institute win. <laughs> you, you get it, man. I make things around here. You, you go and do, you do whatever. And come back and I will set you up. I like this guy. I'd appreciate the help. You and me, we will team up. Now, I got all these ideas in my head. Hey there. You need anything? That's a barter. I'll take a look. <clears throat> take a look. Let's see what he got. Oh, he's got some. He's got missile launch. He's got a lot of plasma grenades. I like this guy. Pulse mines. Tinker Tom special sniper. If you are not in combat. Let's see, if you are not yet in combat, increases VAT's accuracy but costs more AP. Nah. Ooh, shipment of screws. I could actually use that. Instead, let me make sure I sell everything. Take it you would like to get your hands on some Institute tech? I should break that down for leather, actually. Hmm. I'm gonna keep the hazmat suit as well. Weighs a little bit, but I'm gonna need it. All right. Uh, all right. Let's go to Carrington now. Testimony told me to give you this. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join HQ. Would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command. But what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Alright. What? You don't think I can handle a dangerous job? The danger doesn't concern me. Your work at the switchboard proves you can deal with that. I just hope the mission doesn't require knowledge about sins in our procedures. Something you've had scant opportunity to learn. Right. Tell me what you need, Doc. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth, H-222. So headquarters, as always, puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. The paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. He may have a good reason to be paranoid. Perhaps he does. And maybe he did the other dozen times he's made our agents jump through these unnecessary hoops. The dead drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper counter sign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. Yes, he did. He taught me what I need to know, including that. It appears our resident pathological liar didn't completely neglect your training. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. 
Why did Dance hate that? There is no reason for Dance to have not liked that. Sweet, a dick doll. That stuff's valuable as hell. I'm gonna keep the automatic laser pistol in there. Hey, Brooke. Your name's Drummer Boy. It's my envious job to keep track of all the dead drops, grab incoming agents, and tell them where they're needed. I don't suppose you want to switch places. <laughs> sure. Hope you know how to use a minigun. Oh, and soak up bullets. <laughs> Yeah, you heavies need a lot of punctuality and attention to detail, right? If so, I'm golden. <laughs> we'll be seeing each other. Why? Hi. You really want the freedom train? By yourself. Kind of, yeah. Overdue for some reconstructive surgery. What we got? Excellent. Increase damage with a weapon I don't have yet. Use the back entrance. Too much traffic through the church in the firm is high. Hmm, what's all this? This looks like junk. Why is it all back here? Didn't they have the chance to fix that yet? I have a feeling there should be a bobblehead in here somewhere. Working or with compartmentalized information is a difficult transition for the edges. Analyzing. Hi, Pam. Pam. Processing. Agent. Bullseye. Your arrival was not calculated. That's a strange way to say hello. Temporarily unable to process verbal input. Still processing. Preliminary adjustments to statistical models complete. Commencing introduction. I was, am, and will most likely be Pam. Predictive analytic machine. Hmm. Well, nice to meet you, Pam. Introductory token recognized. Nice to meet you, too. Unknown entity, I provide first order approximations of the behaviors of all residents of the region. Designated Commonwealth. Huh. Rephrasing. I predict the future. Interesting. But you didn't predict me coming. That's correct. Caution. Biological life forms behave erratically, unpredictably. All output subject to an extremely <laughs> high margin of error. Even if you're wrong sometimes, that's unbelievable. Repeat. Caution. Operation complete. You are a rogue variable, weary. Uh. I'm from Vault 111. Accessing. Conversation terminated. Pending construction of All right, we got to get to Green Top Nursery because it's under attack. You may have noticed. Unfortunately, it means going through an escape tunnel. If I don't get to Green Top Nursery soon enough, it uh, Preston won't like it. Let's just say that. <laughs> if you fail to defend one of your settlements, the population will drop back down to one. Ew. God, I hate escape tunnels. Ah, oh, man. Gotta go through all this bullshit. Terminal only. Yeah, like, terminal only, because I opened it like there was nothing. Alright, I wonder what Green Top near she's under attack by. I don't have any defenses set up there. All right, let's go. Are there enemies nearby? Of course there are. Where are you guys? Hey, who's there? Can I please get out of here? Now. Alright, let's see if I can fast travel now.
No, I, I can't. Oh, yes, I can. Okay. Let's do this. We're going to defend Green Top Nursery, and then I'm going to call it an episode because i got to go to work. Luckily, I have a ride today, otherwise I wouldn't be able to get this last episode in. Mutants. Oh, I'm dead. I was getting hit by a minigun, I'm pretty sure of it. Adhesive is rare, unless you watched my tutorial. I'm gonna have to use medics for this, I think. Dance isn't gonna like it, but oh well. I think I'm almost out of medics. I'm dying. That takes care of the guy who was on the uh, minigun. Anymore? I'm gonna have to repair that turret. I think that's all of them. I only have to take drugs. It's fine. Let's go ahead and see what these guys had on them. Thanks for the laser rifle, bro. It had to be brutes. It couldn't just be regular super mutants. The brutes have everything. Sledgehammers, obviously. The ones with the pipe rifles aren't di aren't worrying to me, but they had mini guns, and that's always annoying. Speaking of which, go ahead into over here. Oh, okay, it's fine. I don't need to actually repair it. Frag grenade and sledgehammers. Yeah, they had two of them with miniguns. How the hell is that fair? Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and sell all that crap off screen, and we're going to continue on in the next episode. What we're going to do in the next episode, I'm not entirely sure of yet. If you guys liked the video, please leave me a like. Make sure to leave me a comment, guys. I will see you guys next time. Muties don't def don't kill my settlers. No, they don't.